Kenya's standard gauge railway has been operating for about six years now. Its passenger service connects the port city of Mombasa and the capital Nairobi, while its freight service holds containers destined for neighboring countries. CDTN's Rapa Nagila takes a look at how this Chinese-supported project has transformed transportation in Kenya. About a kilometer from the standard gauge railway terminal in Nairobi is a huge maintenance yard. Established by the China Railway Rolling Stock Corporation, the supplier of SGR railway vehicles, it is here that locomotive maintenance is carried out. A locomotive is the part of the train that contains the engine. Chen Jun, the production supervisor at the locomotive section, says despite the cultural differences between the Chinese and Kenyan workers, they have a good working relationship. I love my job because I feel very happy working with Kenyan colleagues who are very lively and smart. We Chinese workers get along well with our local apprentices, whether at work or off work. The railway is part of the Belt and Road Initiative, an ambitious program by China that aims to improve regional connectivity and economic integration through infrastructure development. An important aspect of the BRI is technology and skills transfer. Since the SGR began operations, Chinese engineers have passed on valuable maintenance and repair experience to their Kenyan colleagues. You learn new things about maybe technology. Maybe in Kenya, we have not done something like uh, manufacturing. In, in their country, there's those things like manufacturing is something big. To, so you learn something extra. In collaboration with the Kenya Railways, CRRC has designed a training program for engineering students from local universities. Engineering student Tanisha Imali is currently on attachment. Started with the integrated team, then locomotive team, and now I'm on the engine team. Launched in 2017, the Standard Gauge Railway is Kenya's largest infrastructure project since independence. It was constructed by the China Road and Bridge Corporation, a subsidiary of CRRC, but was contracted by the Kenya Railways Corporation at a cost of $3.6 billion. The railway line serves as a model for Sino-African cooperation. I actually love the fact that I work here. I've had to do so many things, to uh, encounter so many challenges, and it has built me as a person and also in my career. With 33 stations along the line, the railway has revolutionized rail transport in the country. If you're going by economy at 1,000 shillings, it's, it's, it's so much cheaper as well. And, you know, yeah, so, so all those compound together, so speed, safety, cost, all those come in and, and, and it's very convenient for me. As a result of the SGR's efficiency, reliability and speed, freight transportation has witnessed rapid growth, helping to decongest the port of Mombasa. Bob Nagila, CGTN, Nairobi, Kenya.